Good beautiful morning, Beans. How are you? How are you doing? How is your... Oh my god, what is today? Wednesday. Wednesday! It's August 12th, I think. Oh yeah, it's my nephew's birthday today. Oh my god, I'm a mess. <sighs> Thought I'd vlog again because a lot of people asked me to vlog more often on my last vlog and I was like, okay, cool. I also just, I love creating for my second channel because as I've said, like reactions are a lot of fun and everything, but reactions are just me like critiquing on other people's art and I like making my own stuff, creating my own stuff, so I love this second channel as an opportunity to do that. It's currently 8 o'clock. Lately, I've been like finally back into getting up early. I had been getting up around 8 and I don't like getting up that late, so I've been getting up consistently at 6.30 every morning, which has been really nice. I'm gonna try and push that to 6.15 tomorrow so I can slowly inch up to 5.30 because like getting up early is my favorite thing in the world to do because you get up and it's quiet and it's peaceful and you just have the whole day ahead of you and I love that, you know? It's just, it's really nice. I'm definitely more of a morning person than a night owl. So yeah, we're just vlogging today, we're just hanging out, we're just chilling. Um, I'm kind of like in the middle today. I feel mostly good, but I could see this day nose diving into something bad if I don't keep myself busy. So no lying in bed with BuzzFeed today, hopefully. Because as much as I love BuzzFeed, the second I like lie down in bed and start being lazy, like I start to I start to feel like really bad and I think it's because like I feel unproductive and just like Lying in bed just like makes me think too much, you know what I mean? I feel like we've been there. I feel so calm at the moment because again, it's it's still early and it's a gloomy day. You guys know how I love gloomy days. I don't know what happened to me. I used to love just like sunny, hot days and now I'm like, is it cold, gloomy, and rainy? Please, like that's all I want. <laughs> so I think I might go take a quick like rinse in the shower just to wake myself up, get dressed so I feel like a person. And then I have to jump into some editing to start the day. Um, I have a video dropping at 9.30, my usual time on a reaction channel. And I want to release Dangerous Woman tomorrow, but I don't know if I'll be able to do that. I guess we'll see. <laughs> I can't get up from this spot. It's Little more human now so what's up realistically i should edit right now even more realistically i don't feel like it <laughs> no i don't know i wanted to get this um video out soon i filmed it yesterday and i wanted to either get it out tomorrow or the next day i don't know i'm not gonna force it because when i like force myself to edit the results aren't even that great like i need to like feel it if that makes sense i'm kind of more in the mood to like do my other creative stuff, <laughs> like work on my latch hook and read and whatnot. I also want to pick up a couple books at Barnes & Noble. Should I do that today? 
I don't know. Let me show you guys what book I started reading this morning. If you care, you might not, but it's okay. I finished the fourth Harry Potter book the other day and I could have just jumped into the fifth because I have the fifth book, but I kind of wanted to take a break and do something else in the meantime. So I picked up this book that I bought like almost two years ago and never read. I bought it because it was on clearance for $6. <laughs> But it's called If You Knew My Sister. I've only read 22 pages, three chapters. They're short chapters. I appreciate short cha chapters so much because it makes it easier to like just pick it up and read a chapter here and there. So far, it's pretty decent. I don't love the writing style at this point, but the story is interesting and I think I'll enjoy it. It's not that long a book. It's like 370 something pages. The font is fairly large if you can see that. So I'm gonna see, I don't know. I also wanna go, as I said, pick up a couple books at Barnes and Noble. Um, I wanna get a poetry book. Unfortunately, the specific one that I want, I'd have to get online because they don't have it in store. I didn't expect them to. I wanna get a poetry book and I wanna get Normal People, the, the book that the show Normal People on Hulu is based on. Um, Normal People is the most relatable television show that I've ever seen in my entire life. So now I'm gonna read the book. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Oh, I really should edit right now, but I don't want to edit. Mm. It was supposed to thunderstorm today, but it's like looking like it's not really gonna do that now. It's just gonna be like hot and cloudy and humid. Ew. Look at him. <laughs> so my mom and I spotted this like single strawberry growing in our front yard and it just got ripe enough to pick it. So we wanted to pick it before like a bunny or something ate it. And we're gonna split the single strawberry today <laughs> because why not? Also my mom's making a smoothie, which we'll probably split. So I gotta get some ice for the blender. Let's go, let's go. <gasps> Jenner, come back. Hi, buddy. Can you see him? <laughs> okay, here's let's the strawberry. Just don't get me. I won't put you in. <laughs> right Ready? Yeah, cut it. Nom, 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 nom. See both sides. <laughs> what a special little guy. Mm, I'll take this one. Look at this little guy. He's good. He's juicy. <gasps> it's Ryan. Good morning. Good morning. just want to chill until I at least finish drinking it. So I think what I'm going to do is go sit outside and work on my book, the book that I'm writing, and work on that for a little while. And then maybe edit later. I'm pushing editing off and I shouldn't, but like I put out a video today, so it's not the end of the world. It has to wait a day. And if I have to switch Shadow and Dangerous Woman, I can do that. Because Shadow's already filmed. Shadow was filmed a while back. Cool. We'll figure it out. I just want to chill right now. Okay, so there's plenty of like yard work going on out here. It stopped momentarily. It'll start any second again, but you guys know how I feel. 
<laughs> about the noise of like lawn mowers and leaf blowers and all that, like, oh, it bothers me immensely. But it's okay. I was doing everything handwritten before. It was just, it wasn't practical in the slightest because I was like trying to keep everything organized. It was a mess. So I made an Evernote notebook for all of like the poems and stuff. And it's just more organized, I guess. So. I kind of transferred everything from here onto the computer. It's very nice out right now. I'm in the shade. I'm in the shade, so it's okay. But like, normally, no. The smoothie's really good, by the way. It probably doesn't look it, because it's like <laughs> green and everything. I'm gonna end up with spinach in my teeth. Just don't worry about it. The strongest flavor in this one's banana, but there's like, there's banana, blueberry, mango, spinach, ice, water. I think that's it in this one. It's so nice sitting out here. <laughs> This is part of why I don't want to go back to LA because I don't have anywhere to just sit outside. My apartment um, is on a main road and there's nowhere for me to go, so I'd have to like drive to a park, which is fine, but still, you know. There's like a million bees on that bush. Holy crap. Oh my god. Am I gonna die right now? Please do not come near me, sir. Sir. No. Um, I should probably turn this down so I don't get copyright. Listening to Harry Styles. Well, not just listening to Harry Styles. Listening to a playlist that he happens to be featured on a lot, and I love his music, so it works out. But I worked on my writing for a little bit, and basically all I did was try and, like, work on the first poem. Um, I've written, like, I kind of, like, reworked it, and I really like where it's at right now, so that's what I pretty much did for the past, geez, like, 45 minutes. I just, like, kind of crafted that and thought about that and worked on that, and... Feel good. Again, like this writing thing has been the most therapeutic thing ever. For whatever reason, it just like feels so good to just like write all your feelings out. I don't know. If you've never tried it, I recommend. Highly recommend. But now that I've been writing, like I really want to pick up a couple poetry books because like my poetry books that I own are back in LA and that's not very helpful to me right now. <laughs> so I want to go pick up a couple so I can get back into reading poetry. Since I'm writing it, I think it'll be like kind of useful to have that source of inspiration, so to speak. I might hop in my car and go to Barnes & Noble. We'll see. Maybe I'll do a little bit of editing first and then go. <sighs> I'm going to the bookstore. It's hot as hell out here. Can I just say that? Oh my God. I decided I'm just gonna go to the store and get the books that I want because why not. Also, I want to listen to the lakes and the only time I can listen to the lakes is when I'm in my car so I've only listened to it a few times since I listened to it for the first time yesterday. Off to Barnes and Noble we go, which by the way I much prefer going to the store than getting books on Amazon. It's just, I don't want Barnes and Noble to close like every other bookstore. Like come on Amazon, you're ruining the world. <sighs> Makes me sad. <laughs> Did I turn it on? I did turn it on. Hi! So we made it to the bookstore. I didn't get to the lakes. I only made it up to Peace, but I'll make it to the lakes on the way home. Also, I'm across the street from Savers, so I might run in there and just see if there's anything that catches my eye just quickly. Although, we know how that works out. Quickly run into the store and then buy everything in it. But I'm gonna go in here and grab a poetry book or two. I don't think it'll take long, because I just kind of want to grab a couple quick books and that's it. Did I put my key away? Yeah. poetry books by um, my favorite poet Madison I have both these books they're back in um, back in LA right now so I can't read them but here they are on the bookshelf I love them the poetry 
poetry book that I really wanted, I'd have to get online. I just found it. It's Madison's first book that I really, really have wanted to read because I've read her other two. I didn't have this one yet, so here it is. So which means I have to get rid of one of my other ones though. I'm making a sad face under the mask. This is actually a poetry book that I'm currently reading back in LA. I'm somewhere in the middle of it. It was a gift from a friend. It's really, really cool. Definitely recommend. Um, LOL. Okay, so <laughs> I was gonna show you uh, my books when I got back to um, the car at Barnes & Noble, but um, there was like somebody sitting next to me in their car and I was like, this is awkward. But I ended up getting two poetry books. I got the one 18 Years by Madison, which I'm so happy they had it. it. said they didn't have it online, so I'm very excited. And then I got this other one called Flux. It looks really interesting and I'm very excited to read it. Um, I found Normal People and I would have gotten it. Oh my god, there's somebody next to me. They're definitely judging me. It's fine. I found Normal People and I would have gotten it, but it was $17 and I already spent like $30 on these two books and I was just like, can't do it. It looks kind of busy at Savers right now, so I'm just gonna probably run in quick, see if anything stands out to me and then leave because I have to pee and I'm hungry, so I should probably get home soon anyway. So yeah, let's go do that. So, maybe I spent more time in there than I intended. Maybe that happened. Maybe my hair is a mess. Maybe my life's a mess, but I, I bought a lot of stuff in there. And it's all like weird patterns and such, but. So yeah, I bought more than I intended to, but it was fun, so it's okay. The guy who helped me at the counter was adorable. Just thought I'd say that. Time to go home. It's 1.41, there's a soccer game I wanna watch at three, which I'm gonna watch and edit at the same time. So yay, heading home. I need to turn the AC on like right now cause it is hot as hell in here. And I wanna go home and pee and eat. Hi, okay. So I just got home. First thing I want to do really, I'm going to get lunch and wash those clothes that I just bought so that I can try them on and everything because you know, when you buy secondhand, I mean, you should pretty much always wash whatever you buy, but especially when you buy things secondhand. Um, but I'm so excited about my poetry books. I'm so excited. I haven't read poetry. I can't keep you guys up. Um, I haven't read much poetry like in months just because my poetry books were back in LA and I didn't buy any. So now I have two new ones and they're both black and white covers which is kind of fun i'm very excited about them oh i didn't even s oh, the back of madison's book i didn't even see before this book is meant to be bent and worn written in te tear stained and loved this book is for you oh, i love her so much <laughs> back on my rice binge. It's it's not good, but it's good. Basically what I'm going to do now, I just made myself rice with butter and soy sauce again because it's like all I've been eating lately. It's delicious. I'm going to eat this, probably watch an episode of BuzzFeed Unsolved while I eat my lunch. Then it'll be time for the soccer game at three o'clock. Um, and later I want to show you guys the things I got from Savers once they come out of the washing machine. It's been a really good day. Like I'm really happy today. It's 2.41 and I just feel like I've had such a jam-packed day. I wasn't productive in the sense that I didn't really edit, but, but that's okay because I'll edit tomorrow. And again, I put out a video today, so. <laughs> I'm trying not to let my reaction channel stress me out because it becomes less fun when it starts to get stressful. So I'm gonna eat my rice. I'm very excited. I'm so hungry. My stomach is yelling at me right now. So I need to go eat. I gotta say it does look as imposing in person as it does on It just started like pouring out of nowhere and my windows are wide open. So I'm ready. Oh no. No, 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 no. Okay, we're safe. The rain is coming from the other direction. Oh, there I was, enjoying BuzzFeed Unsolved. 
And then the rain said hello. I'm happy it's raining though, I do love the rain. It does make me quite happy. I can only open this door for a hot second. <laughs> but, there it be. It's a raining. I do really mean it when I say the rain makes me happy. I don't know what it is. It's like the most calming, beautiful thing in the world, and I love it. <laughs> oh wow, my arm's getting very wet. What the? Is everybody okay out there? That was weird. Y'all heard that, right? It's okay, buddy. So I'm gonna try and do this fairly quickly, but I figured what I would do right now is show you guys everything I got from Savers. So I'm gonna do like just like a try on walkthrough. I have a feeling neither of these pairs of jeans are gonna fit me. I don't think I'm as small as I thought I was. Let me like start by trying these on. Okay, actually they fit. They're a little on the tight side, but they fit and they're high waisted. Oh wait, they're actually they fit! Oh my god, I'm so excited. I didn't think they were gonna work. They work though. Do you like them? I don't know. I like them. Oh, I'm not sure these were to fit and they fit and they fit nicely. They're not like super short. I hate when shorts are like up here. Yes! That's a victory right there. <laughs> oh, I can finally take this dress off. I love this dress, but it's also like sweater material and it's a million degrees. Okay, so these shorts are so cute. I wasn't sure. Oh my god, I love them. The other pair of shorts that I bought, um, I don't know about. <laughs> they were in the kids section. <laughs> These also might not fit because they're a kid's 12, but look how cute these are. Are you kidding me? I don't know. I don't know. This might be like, this might, this might be bad. I'll, I'll be right back. Wait a second. Oh my God, shut, shut the front door. <gasps> oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God, they fit and I love them. Are you kidding me? Okay, I don't care that these are for like fifth graders. I think they're super cute. These are absurdly high-waisted. These are so funny because they're like way, way up. <laughs> I love them. Oh my god, I don't know what I'll wear them with necessarily, but I think they're super cute. I meant to show you the first piece before I put it on, but it's this shirt, so I'm gonna go put it on now. Oh, it's cute. It looks cute. Ooh. This is all like embroidered, so it's not just like a print. It's like an embroidered. It's really cute. Wait, this is really cute too. Ooh. I'm not like tucking it in all the way just because I don't feel like dealing with it, but oh, I like this too. Is this not cute? Do you guys like it? I really like it. Oh, I'm excited. Okay. The next thing is this like button up sort of shirt. Oh my God. No way. Oh my God. Wait, I love everything like so far. Usually I hate something by now, but I don't know if you like it looks a little weird on camera, but in person I think it's way cuter. I'm so excited. <laughs> the next thing is this. This was like two bucks or something. Really basic. Just like a white tee with this kind of like interesting collar of sorts. Okay, it's like super see-through, so like don't worry about that for now. But it's cute. I think like this is kind of just what I expected. Just like a simple kind of white t-shirt. Oh my god. Very see-through. Not cute. No, I like it. Ooh. <laughs> The next two things are very experimental, as you can see in my hand right now. This is a 2X, so it's gonna be very large, but it's just a button up that looks like this. I know, I know, I don't know what I'm doing either. It even has shoulder pads in it, y'all, like legit. Oh my god, I feel like I'm giving off such Billie Eilish vibes right now. Billie Eilish, Billie Eilish, <laughs> Billie Eilish. See, I probably would wear black under it. Oh my god, this is gonna take some confidence to walk out of my house in this but i do like it oh see see with the black tank top oh yeah a look a look a look you know what i mean my, i love the shoulder pads it looks so ridiculous but that's why i love it like if i did like the one button kind of situation i could do that too what's up i'm here to party they wouldn't let me in but that's okay and last but certainly not least we have another button up that's a little ridiculous. And it's this one. Oh my god, wait, I love it. 
Oh, this one's way cuter. Oh, oh, I like it. I like it a lot. Do you guys like it? I could do the one button on this one too. Oh, this is cute. Oh, this is cute. Oh, it's really fun too. It's very flowy. I'm actually four years old. Welcome to my channel. Oh my God, I didn't even button it right. That's not even correct. I, I almost didn't get this one because I was like, I don't, I don't know. I'm so glad I got it. I'm just really happy right now. <laughs> I literally love everything I got. Last time I went, um, I got a bunch of stuff that I still haven't worn and don't think I will wear. But this time, I think I'm gonna wear all of it. This is adorable. I might just continue to wear this for the rest of the day. Well, that's my little savers haul. I don't know if I'm gonna vlog anymore today just because I um, don't really have much going on. I mean, that's a lie. My nephew's coming over because it's his birthday, but when you put children in, t in your videos now, like YouTube can basically own your life. So I think I'll end this vlog here. Um, thank you guys for hanging out with me today. Um, maybe I'll vlog again this week. Maybe I'll do that. I don't know. Do you want me to? Let me know. Well, thank you guys for being amazing. I'm glad I had a good day. Today was a really good day. Today, like, made me super happy. And I think it's because, like, I'm back to creating some things that I liked creating in terms, instead of, like, just reaction content. So, thank you guys for hanging out with me. Thanks for coming. I appreciate it. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, beans!